Normally what happens during pregnancy is that the baby lies in a bag of fluid. Now this bag protects the baby from sudden impact from the outside and it also prevents infection from coming from the vagina towards the baby and attacking it. Normally what happens is during uh, labor pains the bag of water ruptures right at the end of the first stage of labor usually but sometimes in 15% of cases it ruptures before the labor pains begin. So how do you get to know that? You notice a sudden gush of water or a continuous trickle of water leaking through your vagina, wetting your underclothes, going right down to your thighs and legs. Now this has to be, this fluid is usually colorless and it has no smell. You must note the amount and the color and the time when it all starts. Suppose it is greenish in color or it is blood stain, then it's best to inform your doctor immediately and go straight to the hospital. But in any case, do not panic and don't keep staying at home and waiting for things to happen or especially labor pains to happen because in the meantime the germs may travel from the vagina and reach the womb and attack the baby so once you're in the hospital the doctor examines you and if you're in the ninth month then the doctor will probably induce artificial pains and there is nothing to fear about artificial, artificial pains either Suppose you have not reached the ninth month and you're still in your eighth or the seventh month or the sixth month, then the doctor admits you. She uh, starts the treatment, she observes you for infection and she also gives treatment to the baby for its lungs to mature so that it can cope with the outer world when it is delivered. And then the, uh, the doctor delivers you at the appropriate time.